The Aegean Sea, a body of water as blue as the sapphires it once concealed, stretches out like a vast, shimmering canvas. It cradles within its embrace a constellation of islands, each one a gem in this aquatic tapestry. These are the Greek islands, each a world unto itself, yet bound together by the threads of history, myth, and an almost magical allure. The whitewashed houses with their iconic blue roofs stand as a testament to the island's timeless charm. Our journey begins on Zakynthos, an island where verdant hills plunge into the azure waters of the Ionian Sea. This island, known for its stunning landscapes and rich history, is a gem in the heart of Greece. Here on the northwest coast lies a site that has captured the imaginations of travelers for decades, Navagio Beach, more commonly known as Shipwreck Beach. This beach is not just a natural wonder, but a place steeped in mystery and intrigue. Hemmed in by towering limestone cliffs, this secluded cove is renowned for the skeletal remains of the MV Panayotis, a hapless cargo ship that ran aground here in 1980. The cliffs, standing like silent sentinels, add to the dramatic aura of the place. Legend has it that the ship was smuggling contraband cigarettes, but whatever its true cargo, the wreck has become an iconic landmark. Its rusted hull, a stark contrast to the pristine white sands and the dazzling turquoise waters. The story of the MV Panayotis is now intertwined with the identity of Navadio Beach. But Zakynthos holds treasures beyond this picturesque scene of maritime misfortune. The island is a treasure trove of natural beauty and hidden gems waiting to be discovered. Venture beyond the bustling beach bars and tourist throngs, and you'll discover a world of hidden coves, sea caves adorned with stalactites, and traditional villages seemingly frozen in time. These villages offer a glimpse into the island's past, where time seems to stand still. The island is also a haven for wildlife, particularly the endangered loggerhead sea turtle, Coretta Coretta. These gentle creatures are an integral part of the island's ecosystem. Each summer, these ancient mariners return to the shores of Zakynthos, their journey guided by instinct and the pull of the tides, to lay their eggs on the very same beaches where they themselves hatched. This timeless cycle of life continues to be a testament to the enduring beauty and resilience of nature. Northward we journey across the Ionian Sea to the island of Corfu, a verdant tapestry of olive groves, cypress-clad hills and azure waters. Known as Kerkira in Greek, Corfu has long been a crossroads of cultures, its strategic location at the mouth of the Adriatic Sea attracting the attention of empires and invaders for millennia. The island's rich history is etched into its very architecture, nowhere more evident than in Corfu town, the island's capital. Here, Venetian fortresses, remnants of a bygone era when Corfu was a Venetian stronghold, stand guard over a labyrinthine old town, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Wander through the narrow cobblestone streets of the old town, and you'll be transported back in time. Elegant Venetian mansions with their pastel-coloured facades and wrought-iron balconies line the streets, their faded grandeur a reminder of Corfu's opulent past. The aroma of strong Greek coffee and freshly baked pastries wafts from traditional cafenia, coffee houses, where locals gather to discuss the day's events, their voices a melodic counterpoint to the gentle strumming of a buzuki. Naxos, the largest of the Cyclades islands, is a place where ancient myths and modern life intertwine. Here, on the edge of a peninsula overlooking the Aegean Sea, stand the ruins of the Temple of Apollo. These towering marble columns, weathered by centuries of sun and wind, are a testament to the island's rich history. Legend has it that the god Apollo himself was born on the nearby island of Delos. He was said to be a gifted musician, and the lyre, a stringed instrument, became one of his symbols. Each year, festivals were held in his honor, with music and dance filling the air around the temple. Today, as the sun dips below the horizon, casting long shadows across the ruins, one can almost hear the echoes of those ancient celebrations. The capital Cora carries all the typical features of a Cyclades island, with the fortified town, cobblestone alleys, and the Venetian walled houses. The front doors of the grand residences still bear the coat of arms of their Venetian owners. The narrow back streets and the galleries, the Catholic churches and the fortifications have created a unique mixing of Cycladic and medieval architecture.
Syros, nestled in the heart of the Cyclades, presents a captivating blend of ancient allure and neoclassical grandeur. Unlike its neighbors, known for their whitewashed houses and blue-domed churches, Syros boasts a unique architectural tapestry. This distinction arises from its fascinating history, shaped by a tale of two cities. On the one hand, we have Anno Syros, perched high on a hilltop. This medieval settlement, founded by the Venetians in the 13th century, seems frozen in time. Its labyrinthine alleyways, winding staircases and tightly packed houses evoke a sense of mystery and intrigue. In stark contrast, down by the harbour lies Ermupoli, the island's capital. This elegant city, established in the 19th century, became a major trading hub, attracting settlers from across the Aegean. They brought with them their own traditions and architectural styles, resulting in a remarkable fusion of neoclassical mansions, Venetian townhouses, and traditional Cycladic houses. This architectural tapestry is a testament to Syros's rich and diverse past, a physical manifestation of the island's cultural heritage. It's a place where East meets West, where history and modernity intertwine, creating a unique and captivating atmosphere. Mykonos, a jewel of the Aegean Sea, is an island that needs little introduction. Known for its vibrant nightlife, stunning beaches and charming architecture, the town of Chora is a picturesque labyrinth of narrow streets, whitewashed houses and vibrant bougainvillea. The island's rich culture is evident in its traditional music, dance and festivals that bring the community together. Mykonos is also steeped in history, with ancient ruins and historical sites that tell the story of its past. From its origins as a humble fishing community to its transformation into a bustling tourist destination, the island has retained its unique charm. Local cuisine, especially fresh seafood dishes, offers a taste of Mykonos's culinary heritage. The natural beauty of Mykonos is undeniable, with its crystal clear waters and stunning beaches that attract visitors from around the world. As the sun sets, the island is bathed in a warm glow, creating breathtaking views and a serene atmosphere. The iconic windmills, though just one aspect of the island, add to its scenic landscapes and historical charm. Mykonos's enduring allure lies in its blend of natural beauty, rich history and vibrant culture. The island's traditions and cultural events continue to captivate visitors. The rhythm of life on Mykonos is dictated by the forces of nature, offering a sense of nostalgia for a simpler time. The windmills stand as proud sentinels, guarding the entrance to Mykonos town, a visual delight with every corner offering a new surprise. Visitors from all corners of the globe flock to Mykonos to capture the perfect photo of these iconic structures. Their images shared across social media, further cementing the island's status as a symbol of enduring allure. Mykonos is more than just a destination. It is a testament to the timeless beauty and charm of the Greek islands. And now we journey to Crete, the largest of the Greek islands, a land steeped in myth and history. Here, the very air whispers tales of mighty kings and mythical beasts, for this is the legendary home of the Minoans, a civilization that flourished millennia ago. Their legacy is etched across the island, but nowhere more profoundly than at Knossos. This sprawling palace complex, a labyrinth of courtyards, chambers, and vibrant frescoes, offers us a glimpse into the sophistication of Minoan culture. Imagine, if you will, the bustle of life that once animated these corridors. Kings and queens plotting in shadowy chambers, artisans crafting exquisite jewelry, and priests performing sacred rituals in honor of their gods. The Minoans, it seemed, lived in harmony with nature, their art often depicting the beauty of the natural world around them. The bull, the dolphin, the octopus, all woven into their cultural tapestry. Our next destination takes us to Santorini, an island forged by fire and sculpted by the sea. Here, the very earth bears witness to the raw power of nature, a testament to the cataclysmic eruption that forever changed the island's destiny. Approaching Santorini by sea, you're greeted by a sight that takes your breath away. Towering cliffs rising majestically from the Aegean, their whitewashed houses clinging precariously to the volcanic rock. This dramatic landscape, a caldera formed by the collapse of a massive volcano is a sight that has captivated travelers for centuries. And as the sun begins its descent, casting long shadows across the caldera, 
The island is bathed in an ethereal glow, a truly magical spectacle. The air is filled with the scent of bougainvillea, its vibrant blossoms cascading over whitewashed walls, while the gentle sound of the waves lapping against the shore creates a soothing melody. Our journey now takes us to Rhodes, an island steeped in history and legend, where the echoes of ancient civilizations mingle with the vibrancy of modern Greek life. For centuries, Rhodes has stood at the crossroads of East and West, its strategic location in the Aegean Sea attracting merchants, invaders, and empires. Dominating the island's skyline is the magnificent medieval city of Rhodes, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, and a testament to the island's rich past. Here, within its imposing walls, a labyrinth of cobblestone streets awaits, leading you on a journey through time. As you wander through its narrow alleyways, imagine the clash of swords and the thunder of hooves as knights once rode through these very streets. Look up, and you'll see the watchful gaze of gargoyles peering down from ancient buildings, silent guardians of the city's secrets. The air is thick with the scent of spices, a reminder of the island's trading past, while the sound of laughter and conversation spills out from bustling cafes, a testament to the enduring spirit of the Rhodian people. Our journey takes us now to Kefalonia, the largest of the Ionian islands, a land sculpted by ancient forces both geological and mythical. Hidden beneath the surface lies a secret world of breathtaking beauty. The Melisani Cave, a subterranean lake of ethereal beauty, awaits. As sunlight streams through a collapsed cavern ceiling, the waters below shimmer with an otherworldly turquoise glow. It's a spectacle that has captivated travelers for centuries. Legend has it that this cave was once a sanctuary for nymphs, their laughter echoing off the cave walls. While the nymphs may be figures of myth, the sense of wonder they embody is palpable in the hushed reverence of visitors today. Surrounded by the stalactites and stalagmites, shaped over millennia by the slow drip of mineral-rich water, one can't help but feel a sense of insignificance in the face of such timeless grandeur. Our final island adventure takes us to Lefkada, an island where the Aegean Sea carves a dramatic landscape of sheer cliffs, hidden coves and beaches that defy description. Connected to the mainland by a narrow causeway, Lefkada has a mystique all its own. The coastline of Lefkada is a testament to the power of nature. Towering white cliffs, sculpted by wind and wave, rise dramatically from the turquoise waters below. These cliffs, some reaching heights of over 300 feet, are not just a geological marvel, but a haven for unique flora and fauna. Look closely, and you might spot Eleonora falcons, their wings tracing graceful arcs against the azure sky. These majestic birds of prey, found only on a few remote islands, are a symbol of Lefkada's wild beauty. And nestled amongst these towering cliffs are hidden coves, accessible only by boat, their secluded beaches lapped by the crystal clear waters of the Ionian Sea. These hidden gems offer a glimpse of paradise, a place to escape the crowds and reconnect with nature's tranquility. From the volcanic landscapes of Santorini to the ancient ruins of Crete, from the vibrant nightlife of Mykonos to the tranquil beaches of Lefkada, the Greek islands offer a tapestry of experiences as diverse as the islands themselves. Each island, a world unto itself, beckons with the promise of adventure, relaxation, and a journey through time. Explore the remnants of ancient civilizations, wander through charming villages untouched by time, and lose yourself in the warmth of the Greek sun. Whether you seek adventure, relaxation, or a journey of cultural immersion, the Greek islands offer something for everyone. So answer the call of the Aegean Sea and discover the magic that awaits in these jewels of the Mediterranean.